guys, welcome back to another little geeky reviews. Now that I've actually got all of the Sun Man, I was uh, putting them all on display and I'm thinking, which ones do I like better? Which ones do I bring to the front? Which ones am I not too fussed on? And I thought I would just quickly go through it with you guys. So, there is 10 of them. I think, it, yep, 10 in total. So let's do a little top 10. So coming in at number 10, we have at the back here hit now so hit now he's got this little eagle which doesn't really fit firmly on his cuff so that's one bugbear of mine the other bugbear so although I quite like the orange and the yellow it's this hat it doesn't, you've got to push it down on his head but then you'll see it just go boop and start sliding up a bit and again what's with this friggin lollipop there could have been different feature maybe actually on the armour rather than hold this goofy little thing up so yeah Hypno comes in at number 10 for me coming in at number nine is Boltman. So Boltman again, although I like the colour, it's mainly I don't know, it's just a bit it's just a bit cheesy with these weapons. I throw electric bolts at you. If you've got one of them in his hands, it just looks a bit corny to me. <laughs> so that's why Boltman comes in at number nine. So number eight and number seven. So I'm doing these both. Is we're going back over to this side. And it is... Kitco and Zapman. So let's go in for Kitco first. It's the only thing that bugs me, although I like all these little throwing stars. The some of them are just quite loose of the cuffs. They're not really secure like this one. Just spins. It doesn't doesn't actually fix on nice and firm. And also his little holster to actually put these throwing stars in. It just stores the one. I would have preferred like a bigger pack on his back. Or something to put them all in rather than having them all just balancing on a little peg on his arms and his legs especially with them being that loose so that's why he comes in at number eight for the next one is Zapman so coming in at number seven so you've got again these little antenna things that go on his gauntlets but again, mine, they're just loose. They don't secure on it properly. And then again, this helmet, I don't know what's, why it's shaped. It's just weird, weird shape on it for the little old Zap Man. It looks like that, um, the start of, what is it, the Paramount? type of movies 
So number six comes in at Pighead. It was a cross between him. It was close to get into the top five. But I thought, no, I am keeping him in at number six. No real reason, to be fair. His actual accessories I actually quite like. It's kind of, I just, I just don't know. I think it's the head itself. I don't know, it just like, it doesn't come to me like a Origins type of figure look on it, to be fair. But yeah, he comes in at number six. Number five is the Space Sumo. Why he's Space Sumo, I don't know. I don't know the backstory on this guy. Again, it's the helmet keeps riding up on its own. So you'll be looking out of his little visor one day and then another day it'll just be boop up here. So coming in at number four we have a Duplico. So he is one of the recent ones I have got to finish off the line. So he is a little cracker. I don't know why I've put him in. Uh, top four to be fair I think because it, it is the most recent one and he's been more elusive for it as well I kind of love that funky little quiffy hairdo and bleach blonde type of look on it as well so he's in at number four number three um, I'm going to go for some man himself so for number three, I have seen um, better wings than these getting done on Etsy, where it's the proper big angel wings as well. So I'm probably deliberating on getting one of them off that line and replacing this big collar one, maybe. Maybe, not too sure yet. But number three for him. Number two... Digitino. So, again, coming in at second, I love anything that glows up in the dark. So, when uh, this, where I've got this display all set, set up in the night time, you just see his little chest, his little torso, armour gleaming out from all the other rest. And for number one, bit controversial I reckon there's Holographo oh, the pizza man I honestly do not know why I love this guy so much so I don't know whether it's his accessories his face sculpt it's probably his face sculpt to be fair it's, probably, it's like that proper 70s type of look on it you know so he's an absolute cracker but there it is, the Sun Men collection. So let me know your thoughts. What would you rate? Get drop us in the comments your ratings. So your top ten. Are they the same as mine? Do they come close? Or are they completely different? Let me know your thoughts. But thanks for checking in on this one. And I will catch you on the next. Take care.